uh, let's start our recording here all right uh, so welcome everyone um, so I'm right now located in the robotics laboratory in our department uh, it's called ROLAB robotics and automation systems laboratory uh, so you know during the uh, COVID-19 uh, times uh, I'm also sometimes using the lab as a kind of a lecture uh, venue so uh, what we are planning today is to have an introductory uh, lecture uh, to uh, EE302 uh, feedback systems um, so uh, what I'm going to try to do is uh, mostly try to avoid uh, going uh, back to the board maybe at the end if we have some time uh, I will just switch back to a whiteboard and maybe uh, try to kind of uh, touch upon uh, some uh, introductory fundamentals now uh, this course and the control field in general is uh, as we have discussed in the option seminar is a highly mathematical field okay and uh, the reason this is uh, so mathematical is that um, what we try to do is build mathematical models of systems and use those models in order to uh, essentially modify the behavior of such systems okay now uh, during this time what i'm going to try to do is to uh, essentially give you a taste of uh, why we care uh, about uh, so much uh, mathematical concepts and so much theory uh, and uh, during both the course of this course hopefully uh, as a project and also uh, in the course of the coming lectures in the fourth year you will really taste uh, how these uh, theoretical concepts can be applied in practice okay uh, but without this fundamental background it's very difficult to solve uh, some of the more difficult problems that I will show you as examples so uh, within this two hours what we will try to do is look at uh, very basic concepts the fundamental concepts and then we will uh, basically see uh, some uh, internet videos that are really uh, very much related with uh, the topics that we will discuss uh, in terms of applications uh, of those uh, theoretical concepts uh, let me very briefly talk about myself although we since we no longer have like a section concept this slide is kind of it uh, a bit out of date because uh, hopefully uh, all of you guys will have a chance to see all of us so beside myself, obviously, uh, teaching the courses, uh, Kemal Librevicioğlu, uh, Emre Özkan and Mert Ankaralı, uh, who are also part of the teaching staff. Uh, we also have two uh, teaching assistants that I will uh, introduce uh, very, very uh, in the next couple of slides. OK, uh, so how I came to be here? Well, I graduated from this department in 93. Then I had my master's degree in Imperial College in London. Uh, and then I came back for my PhD studies, and uh, which I finished in year uh, 2000, uh, after which I went to, uh, to Canada uh, as an immigrant, actually, to work in industry for about five years. Uh, and I came back uh, to be uh, part of the teaching and research staff in, in METU uh, in 2005. So since that time, I'm uh, the end of 2004, beginning of 2005, I've been here uh, doing research in the field of robotics, uh, teaching uh, and research in the field of control systems. Uh, so uh, and I also have taught uh, quite some time uh, the engineering design courses of our department. OK. Uh, yes. Ben e, başka bir yerden alıyorum. Yani kendi ekranımı kaydederek alıyorum. E, Zoom'dan kaydetmiyorum. Tamam hocam. Teşekkürler. Tamam. Rica ederim. Okay. So uh, now before we start, uh, I want to have maybe five to ten minutes uh, short break for you to kind of introduce you to also uh, 
uh, to the kind of procedures that uh, that we will have. Uh, now, what I want you guys to uh, do is participate. In fact, uh, I termed this a quiz and I emailed you as such, uh, but this is nothing but uh, a short survey, in fact, where I have four questions for you um, that I would like you to answer within this uh, five, 10 minutes period. Uh, is essentially, I want you guys to think about uh, this term and your objectives for this term and about this course uh, and maybe sp spend a couple of uh, minutes uh, to answer those questions, okay? So I will, uh, if you go back to uh, Metu class for me, uh, I'm going to enable uh, this survey uh, over there. So that's going to be visible for you. Uh, and I want you guys to uh, attempt that uh, that survey uh, for me, okay? So let me uh, make that uh, visible. So you should be able to see it right now. Uh, please open up Metu class, uh, go under this week for EE302, and there is a survey called expectation from the spring term, okay? And I will allow you guys to uh, have uh, maybe five, ten minutes time uh, to answer those questions. OK, the, the survey will be open for uh, maybe another hour after, after our lecture. So if you uh, kind of when we continue, if you're not done yet, you can go back and complete that as well. OK. Uh, in the meantime, uh, you can use the chat window to ask me any questions if you want. But obviously, uh, the remaining of the presentation hopefully will also answer some of your questions because we will, uh, after this slide, we will take a look at our syllabus, uh, the course conduct, and so on. Okay. Uh, let me also mention that this is an anonymous survey, so your answers will not be tied with uh, with your name. So you can uh, freely answer uh, the way you want, actually. Do we have any non-Turkish speaking students in our class? Uh, any any people who uh, who cannot speak Turkish or understand Turkish? Okay, you can also answer uh, over the chat window. I'm looking at it right now. So uh, those of you, if we uh, from time to time, if we end up. Uh, switching to Turkish for uh, a short explanation. Uh, if you feel like you are missing something, uh, please uh, let me know, uh, either verbally or through the chat window, uh, so that I can uh, I can cover you guys as well. Uh, but you know, uh, 
that's not going to be, uh, you know, the lectures will be in English. Uh, all the materials that we will post, uh, the video lectures that we will record, uh, all of it will be in English. But during the question and answer sessions that we will have, uh, maybe we can switch to Turkish from time to time to clarify something. Uh, as I said, if you feel like you're missing something, uh, you're welcome to interrupt and uh, ask any questions as well. 